Hello LEGO friends, Matt from Brooks Brooks here. Today I'm going to give you another progress update on my project that's been going on now for a number of weeks, the Brooksville City Airport. This has been quite a fun project it's turned out to be. A little bit longer and bigger than I expected, but I've been very happy with it. Stay tuned and let's take a look. Getting right into it here. Um, I have put the second floor back on top of the first so I can do some comparison and contrast and look at things. Um, I was working on this on my most recent live stream as of recording of this video. Made some significant progress and I'm very happy with the direction it's going. And want to do another update to show you where everything is, what's going on, and how it looks. So I'm going to start back on the second floor again because that's what I've been working on. And we'll have a look here at the escalator coming up. Added in a little sort of ornate railing here looking pretty nice i do have that little kind of portrait hanging up in that window i think it gives a little bit more of a nice look to that you can see i have started doing some tiling here usually when i do tiling that means i am pretty happy with where the direction is going as it usually means it's the last step in the progress of a certain area so you can see pretty much this entire area is complete as far as i'm concerned at least in terms of where placement of things will be so I have tiled it off. You can see here we've got the restroom. We've got the little Burger King shop here. And a little Caesars kind of to-go box slash oven thing, which I actually really like that. Um, that was actually a thing. The build there was actually used in my original airport that I took apart weeks ago. And then I just added on a second um, container box there and popped some stickers on it. I'm actually really happy with it. I think that's um, fairly practical for this build. We've got a nice kitchen going on here. Grill, stove, refrigerator, all that good stuff. Um, we've got a drink fountain over here on the other side. With some dispensers. Oh, looks like we got a Whopper sitting on the counter. <laughs> Again, this is the cafe area. This is pretty much done. I just got to do a sign um, for that, but I, I really like the look of all this and where it is. Very happy with that. We got. I just got to tile stuff in there. Again, this is the central core elevator, which does have a hole in there, so that I can run wiring up through here. Got a recycling bin. This is the main stairway to go up and down. Um, the assumption is, you know, flights come in, folks will go down these stairs usually, and then folks will be coming up the escalator most times. This again is, this will be the main entryway to and from the airport um, to the monorail terminal. And then this is the area where I've done the most recent work here. First, I want to show this new stand shop, which I'm honestly really, really happy with. Um, got a nice little refrigerator there with a bunch of different um, soft drinks using some dot tiles and all that good stuff. Um, also a shelf with a bunch of different things there, goodies, snacks, whatever you can think of. And of course, it's a new stand, so you gotta have some newspaper. And then a little checkout with this little panel to kind of give the impression of, you know, it's a little gate sort of thing. Um, I did want to use these lockers that came from the original Jetway set that I had um, when I first got back into LEGO three years ago. Um, and I took these out of the airport build that I had done. I wanted to put them back in. Felt that they're important and very practical, so there they are. I've also started kind of mapping out the gate area here. So we've got some chairs of various sorts. Um, more will be kind of lined up here. I don't know exactly where the actual gates itself and the, um, you know, the, the desk and all that stuff will be. It will be somewhere in this area um, to be determined. I got to figure out a few more things here. But the last thing I did in the last live stream was I started putting up these windows on this outside ledge. Um, and that was my intention all along, is I didn't want to put any wall on this inside section. Um, I wanted to have a separate, just have like some columns like this um, up along certain pieces of it. Now that'll, that'll be for support here and then the main roof structure. But then this second external structure, which I think is going to be really important because as you're looking in the city, um, you're going to see the front of the building, you're going to see this part of the building. You won't see anything else. And I want to make sure that this in particular is really visible. You can see all the action going on inside when I light it up. So it was very important to me to have a very large expanse of windows. 
So this is basically what it's going to be. I'm going to be tweaking this up a little bit based on where I place the gate. We'll probably have a couple of columns separating some stuff out, but that is kind of the intention and that's where everything is at the moment. So as for now, that's the in-progress report of where the airport stands. I will continue working on this. Um, I still have to do the whole tarmac area here as well and kind of finalize all that good stuff. So there's still definitely more to come. Please check out my live streams um, where I'm working on this again in progress. It'll probably be at least another week or two, I'm sure, that I'll be working on this. Um, probably between another project or two. But as always, I want to thank all my subscribers in particular for watching. Always appreciate your support. If you haven't, please be sure to hit that subscribe, hit the notification bell, like the video, leave a comment thought below, all that good stuff really, really helps the channel and I appreciate it. But until next time, thanks for watching Brooks Bricks and this is Matt saying see ya.